plurality. You just have to have a winner. So right away we can see that Letitia has more votes than anybody else. The winner's going to be Letitia. Let's fill in all the other stuff. Copy all of that. Paste. My total is equal to the sum of all of this stuff. The percent is equal to the number of votes divided by the total times 100. But I want to lock it horizontally onto the total. Otherwise, as I fill down, look what happens. We're going to end up getting division by zero because this one is looking at the 1861, 1861. The next one is looking at the cell below it, CB266, which is this cell right here. To lock it horizontally, I put a little dollar sign between the B and the 265. And then if we fill it down, it's locked on. The 1861 or the 1861 is 100%. It does make sense. We don't need to have over 50%. We just need the highest. And the highest is Letitia. Copy and paste all those values. My total, it's 1861. Paste in the percents. This is 100%. And that's how you do plurality voting with a spreadsheet.